Why the Earth has seasons. The Earth is a sphere that rotates around the Sun. The Sun is a ball of hot gases that is at the center of our solar system. To help scientists understand and explain to others how to find places on Earth, scientists use imaginary lines. The first is the equator. The equator is an imaginary line around the outside of the center of the Earth. The equator divides the Earth into two parts. The upper part is called the Northern Hemisphere. The lower part is called the Southern Hemisphere. The other imaginary line is the axis. The axis is an imaginary line that goes through the North Pole and the South Pole of the Earth. The axis divides the Earth into two hemispheres. They are the Eastern and the Western Hemisphere. Together, the equator and the axis help scientists and others locate different places on our planet Earth. The sun provides light and heat to Earth. The sun rays that have the shortest, straightest path to the Earth are the most direct sun rays. The warmest part of the Earth is where the sun directly shines on the Earth. A location of the Earth that gets or receives the most direct sun rays is also where the equator is located. The part of the Earth that receives the most direct sun rays also receives more heat and light than parts of the Earth where the sun rays take longer to reach. If you were lucky and could view Earth from outer space, you would notice that the North Pole and the South Pole are not at the very top and bottom of the Earth. In fact, the poles are slightly tilted to the right at 23.5 degrees. Now look at the Earth. In this position, the Earth that receives the most direct heat and light from the Sun is the Northern Hemisphere. It is summer in the Northern Hemisphere because the southern hemisphere is receiving less direct heat and light. It is winter in the southern hemisphere. The Earth revolves around the Sun. This path is Earth's orbit. It takes 365 days for the Earth to revolve around the Sun. As the Earth moves for six months, look where the most direct sun rays shine on the Earth. Remember, the axis is tilted to the right. On this side of the sun, the southern hemisphere is receiving the direct rays of the sun, and the northern hemisphere is not. Now, the southern hemisphere is having summer. The Northern Hemisphere is having winter. Why do we have seasons on Earth? The Earth has seasons because the Earth is tilted as it revolves around the Sun.